Welcome back. Now we are going to look at how you can route using the view method. The view method provides a shortcut where you do not need to define the full route or controller. And the, the view method is only used when you want to return a view. And it allows a URL as its first argument and a view name as its second argument. You can also pass in a third argument as an array of data. So let's see how this is done. So the first thing you need to do is on the routes file, you need to change this method from get to view. So I'm going to select all of them and then replace with the view method. Then remove all this closure function. And then remove all this. And now as you can see, we have the first argument as the URL and then a view name as this second argument. So let's see from the browser to see whether it's working. Go to the home page. Perfect. About us. Perfect and web design. Perfect. Now we can now pass that argument. So I'm going to pass an array of data which will have the title. And then welcome. Title about us. And then for the web design, which will be web design. Save. Let's see. Let's now pass this or echo this to the views. So I'm going to the welcome view and replace this with the echo statements. That is the two calibrations. And then the variable is title. So copy this. So which means it will replace that and echo this title, which is welcome and welcome view. So copy this, save and let's put them on the other views that we have for the about us. And then for the web design. Save. Let's see now from the browser. Home page. Perfect, but you can notice. Let's change this to another title. So I'll go to the routes file and replace welcome to home page. Refresh. And as you can see, it has changed. Let's go to the about us. Perfect web design. Perfect. So everything is working perfectly. Now let's put a code to be neat and clean this code. So these are comments, web design, and then welcome. Now our code is neat and clean. So in the next lecture, we'll look at another way of routing and see you in the next lecture.